Congratulations, there's some stunning trot work. Yeah, that's where I've got to always try and pick up the marks with him because he finds that effortless. Um, it's the canter I lose the marks because it changes, but today he seems to nail at least two, I was told. You can never really feel with him because sometimes when it feels horrible, he actually is a clean change. But um, he's always struggled with that, I think, just because he's so long, actually collecting him and getting him to step through, he finds quite difficult. But he really, he did his best he could today, so I'm really happy with him. I can't ask any more of him. Um, you arrived for Canada, but you've been, you've been based in England. Right? Yes, um, my mum is Canadian and she was very um, clever and got me a uh, dual, dual citizenship basically when I was born. My brothers were born there, my parents lived there, but then my dad inherited some land and a farm over here, so I was born over here. So I have lived here all my life, but I, we do have a house over there and I do visit. So um, I'm very lucky to have the opportunity to ride for them and been to many places that I wouldn't have been to. So. And who do you train with? Um, my dressage trainer is Henrietta Anderson. She's she's helped me out amazingly. She's nailed, helped me nail the changes, and she's here supporting me today. Um, and then my my partner, basically Giovanni Ugolotti, who rides for Italy. You know, we um, we're quite good at uh, working together. We try not, to, we're not in competition together. So we we want each other to do the best. So we'll give each other. The, True opinions and, and he's not get offended. Ridden here before yes, too. he's ridden around three times, but he he's not riding around this year. He's saving his horse for the Europeans. So. And um, what are your combined thoughts on the course tomorrow? Whoa, it's 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 going to be tricky. It's going to be tricky. I'm quite lucky that um, I'm later on, so I can see a few people go around it and see what what I think may ride like, what, how it rides. Um, there's so many options, which is a very cool, clever course designer because he's, he makes you think and. You know, you're looking at all the different options. What would be best for your horse? So, um, yeah, I've got a lot to think about. I'll go around again this afternoon. I've really, I've walked it with Andrew Nicholson, who gave me really good insight, which I hadn't thought of. Um, he's been around here how many times? God knows how many times. So, no, I will um, have a lot of things to think about tonight. And what would be your like? I'm sure you'll have, like you said, lots of options and plan A, B, C, D, E. But your initial plan, you know, would you be thinking about going direct, trying to go fast? And yeah. Play? Because like this is my second year. Last year I just wanted to get round. It was just an accomplishment to get round. So this year I would like to go direct on quite a few of them um, at this present time. Um, but uh, if something goes wrong, I'll go long. Do you know what I mean? I've just got to now go and walk it and see the long routes where I don't cross my tracks and stuff. Because in the heat of the moment, you can easily make a mistake very easily. So, but no, at the moment I'd like to go direct on a lot of them. But some of them I don't really know which one is the quicker line, do you know what I mean? So, um, but yeah, definitely, that's that's my plan at the moment, but the plans change. <laughs> What's it like, um, obviously, you know, choosing Canadian nationality is an advantage because if you're English, it's a lot more competitive, yeah. but is it, um, you know, the the sort of North American squad here has got such yeah. great camaraderie, do you fit in with them? Or oh yeah, they're very welcome. Canadians are always welcoming. <laughs> they're a great <laughs> bunch, real great bunch. The thing which, you know, would be the thing that would lack here is because there's not many Canadians over here, we lack the training basically because they're all based over there. But you know, it's expensive to fly over. Yeah. Over here, we don't have a huge amount of funding, so um, whatever we get is just a bonus. But that would be the only minus points. Yeah. I get to go many different places that I would never, like the Olympics, Pan Ams. You know, I'm, I'm very fortunate in that way. But um, they're they're a great bunch over there, and I've been had the pleasure of being on a few teams with them and they're great fun so nice yeah. <laughs> well thanks for chatting congratulations on the great test today thank you very best much best thank of you. luck tomorrow and thank hopefully you. we'll chat here tomorrow yeah. afternoon yes fingers crossed yeah. thank you very much thank you.